Today I have a new Squarespace update for you and it has to do with SEO, which is a good thing. I'm really glad Squarespace is paying attention to SEO, bringing it to the forefront. There are a couple of things that I'm hoping they'll fix as well, but let me show you what's new. Okay, I am here in my starter template and right off the bat, you'll see that there is a new SEO tab here under website. So let's click that. And there are some interesting things here. Uh, I'm not gonna pay attention to traffic, but you can certainly dive into analytics more here if you're interested in that. This is new, your SEO completion score. Now, what this means is how many pages have you added metadata to and how many images have you added alt text to? I think it's a decent metric just to be aware of, but you should also know if for every metadata and every image alt text, I went in and put peanut butter sandwich, this could give me 100%. And that's not really gauging my SEO. It's gauging my SEO completion. So just be aware of that. But this is a really handy way to catch and see if you have any pages or images that need descriptions and you can hit improve with AI. If you're willing to agree to the Squarespace content generation terms, you can explore those here. Um, if that seems okay to you, you can hit okay here, and it's gonna walk you through AI created metadata and then image alt text for every one of your pages and images on your website. So if you don't like it, you can either ask it to regenerate it or you can edit it and change it just how you want it and then click save and move on to the next one it does these in batches so just be aware if you have a lot it can take a while to get through but it will give you a stopping point before you start the next batch this is all good i don't have a problem with this my biggest problem with this panel is that it used to be that when i searched for seo and i went to marketing settings i would go to seo appearance and immediately it would take me to filling out my website metadata for SEO. This is so important. It's my title. It's my description that goes for my whole website that shows Google what my site is about. It should be the first thing here. Instead, we've got add a fave icon. And then over here buried is search appearance. This is what I'm looking for when I'm looking for that SEO tab. Now, Am I going to drill down and find this? Maybe not. So this should be front and center well before traffic. If it's not been completed, it needs to be completed. You can see mine is empty here. I would not even know to check this unless I got way down here um, into this SEO checklist. Now you could make the argument that it will pop up here in these pages with metadata and people will walk through it. I have two concerns there. First, if you're not willing to agree to those Squarespace generated content terms, you're not gonna even get in here. And if you're not in here, you need to be able to access this so much more easily. Secondly, even if you do improve with AI, there's nothing that's telling you that this one is like the big daddy, the really important one. It's just mixed in with all the rest. So again, this tab, which is arguably the most important SEO setting on your website is now buried. So I'm hoping Squarespace, if you're watching this, you're going to make this front and center. This needs to be the most important thing on this page. If you found this helpful, please give the video a like, drop a comment below, or subscribe to my channel. All of those help other people find my videos. Thanks so much for watching, and I wish you all the best with your website.